everybody, this is Miss Heather with the Hagerstown Public Library and it is time with STEAM with me. So today is going to be something short and sweet and a fun project for you to do and it's even edible. So your project for the week is going to be Pringle Ring Challenge. Look at this. And that's all Pringles. How cool is that? So. I'm not going to show you how to do it because that is taking all the fun out of it and the creativity of how to make it. Um, all I let you know is the materials you need is one regular size can of Pringles and um, or a chip like Pringles off brand. Um, I know they have those at all these. Um, that's the only thing you're going to need and you're going to need some engineering and architecture skills for this. Um, it's pretty easy, pretty simple, and the ones that the Pringles that you don't use or you break, it's a built-in snack for you to do. So you are gonna engineer that to make it look like this. Okay? And then what is behind it? So this one involves engineering, architecture, and physics. It's encompassing three different things that people use on a daily basis, but you don't realize it. So how does a Pringles ring work? So as the side of the rings gets taller, gravity pushes down. So gravity is always pushing down on something, okay? On the chips, causing them to slide down. So you got this round, and then in order for the chips not to slide, there must be enough friction or force, which is like them moving together, okay? Going like this, or like this on the sides of the chip so that gravity can't push it down. So with that being said, that's the whole lesson. Um, the fun part about this is trying not to let it topple over as well as it's a built-in snack. Um, so for this week, it's, this is going to be less than a five minute video for you guys. Um, this May and through the summer, I will only be doing two STEAM projects a month to get ready for our summer reading program, which is called Tales and Tales. Um, we have a lot of things to focus on with that. Um, so with that being said, STEAM project videos and the projects will be out twice a month, beginning of the month and towards the middle of the month. Um, I have a few things in mind that are going to be some fun, especially for the summertime, some water involvement, um, a couple other outdoorsy ideas I have kind of brewing around in my head. Um, so like always, this video is going to be out Tuesday at 11 a.m. on our Facebook and will be on the Hagerstown YouTube page as well for the Hagerstown Library YouTube page and Hagerstown Library Facebook page. Click like and join. Um, there's all kinds of cool little sources on there. Um, all the STEAM videos and projects I've done are on both of those. Um, if they are not, they will be updated and uploaded on there soon. Um, so if you're not familiar where our STEAM projects are, there is our circulation desk and across from there we have a three-tier cart on the first tier is the current week's project, so this will be this week's project. Um, the second tier of the cart is the previous week, and then on the very bottom third tier, that is all the previous month, month and a half's projects, depending on how much I weed them. Um, this was something quick and simple I could do with you guys. Um, so, this is Miss Heather, and this is Steam. Bye, guys.